We're focused on the problem of remotely measuring snow water equivalent, the amount of water uh, in a snowpack. The advantage of using wireless sensor networks is lower cost, much lighter weight, and ease of deployment. The state of the art is a snow tail site. And this is a really large 10 by 10 foot rubber bag filled with a couple hundred gallons of antifreeze that measures the load that's on top of it. That information is then stored on electronic data loggers. The 200 gallons of antifreeze is very heavy. The uh, snow pillow is very heavy. You, know, you have to dig um, to install the snow pillow, etc., etc. So it's quite an undertaking to install one of those sites. We're developing a new sort of sensor technology um, based on attenuation of electromagnetic radiation. As a remnant of the Big Bang, uh, the universe is still flooding the Earth with gamma rays. Although these gamma rays will pass through um, just about anything, um, they are stopped to a certain degree by water. We can measure gamma ray uh, spectra in a particular area. As snow builds up over the gamma ray detector, I can measure the change in the gamma ray spectra, and from that, I can extrapolate how much snow is on top of it. As the sensing device is reporting its data, it's transmitted electronically to one of these devices, and then this device can either store that data on board for later collection, or it can transmit data over a radio so having an understanding of what a snowpack is um, is essential to uh, natural resource planning.